A JustAZ.com production. We're going to introduce worms into our aquaponic system today. We purchased red wiggler worms from a local pet supply store. This container holds two dozen worms. Empty the container onto paper towels. Separate the worms from the soil. We put them into a small bowl. If we were releasing these worms into a worm farm or the soil garden, they would be good to go out of the box. But for aquaponic beds, we want to minimize the soil that gets into the system. So we give the worms a quick bath. Put the worms back onto the paper towels and rinse the bowl. Dip each worm into a cup or bowl of room temperature water. Place the worms back into the bowl. Now that we've prepared them, we'll release the worms into their new home. You can see we have debris from spent plants. The worms eat the debris left in the beds, keeping the beds clean. They also leave the worm poop, more commonly called castings. Castings are nutrient dense and those nutrients are immediately available to the plants. The nutrient rich fish water flows into the bed, dissolving the worm castings, making instant worm tea for plants. The plants clean the water and it goes back into the tank. Bob disperses the worms across the top of the bed. Red wigglers live closer to the surface than earthworms, so they won't drown in the water as it flows downward through the bed. The worms appear to adapt easily to the environment and are actively burrowing into the clay pellets. We'll come back in a few days and see how they're doing. There's noticeable improvement in the condition of the bed. The worms have eaten a lot of the debris. Bob pulls up a spent plant and we can see a worm has made himself at home. It's been about two weeks since we put the worms in the aquaponics bed. And as you can see, they are eating up all the debris and our beds are getting clean. We are gonna be ready to plant again in about a week. And we'll start adding worms to this aquaponics bed. Uh, worms are going to be a vast improvement to the maintenance of our aquaponic system. Thanks for watching and subscribe to our channel for more videos on the DIY lifestyle.